Many people probably would have said it wasn't possible to do what we've done here. Build a beautiful state-of-the-art facility. This is a huge event for the community and for our staff. My name is Olive Clark and my present position at the hospital is on the front information desk in the front lobby. I've been at Tobico General for 54 years. I am the last remaining original who joined in 1965. The area that the hospital lives in has changed tremendously over the years, I would say more than doubled. And right now our lobby is not large enough to deal with the number of patients that we have. We really need space more than we have now. The original tower for Etobicoke General was built by the community. So funds had to be raised over 50 years ago to make a dream a reality. And those women and men in that day did their part. They raised $4.7 million. Now we're in the process, thanks to next generation of caring leaders, to come forward in amounts large and small and to raise $25 million. And we kind of carry on and we benefit from people who paid it forward on a day like this about 50 years ago. The Etobicoke Matters campaign is the biggest campaign that's ever been run in this hospital's history. This is Etobicoke's hospital and it always will be. And this community really wants to stand behind the hospital. They really value the services that we offer. It's really difficult to describe in words how excited our team, our volunteers, all of our staff are. Every time I work in the emergency department, we talk about the date that we're opening. We talk about the new unit. We will finally be able to equate our space to the kind of care that we provide. In the space we're in currently, we're fighting to fit all the equipment that we need to do the right job and to do the correct job for the patients. We're constantly shuffling things around to try and make space. Over here, we won't have that problem at all. With this new space, we will now have a more welcoming area for family members of our patients, which I think is very important. Family is the key at Etobicoke General Hospital. We'll also have new updated equipment for better communication between staff members and between patients and their families. It's clean, it's big, it's bright. The nursing station's a lot bigger. My team and I are looking forward to getting in here, working together, and super excited to start this new chapter. What's happening here today is a public tour, so it's kind of a sneak peek behind the scenes of the new tower at Etobicoke General. I love the fact that most of the rooms have windows, which is great. They're so much larger. You've got room for patients and family and all that, where before it was so crowded. What impressed me was just how welcoming it seems to be here. The space is well laid out with good flow. I am a healthcare professional myself, so I'm all about efficiency if we can get patients in and tested in a timely fashion, so really like the layout. It's definitely forward thinking with an eye towards the future, which is great. Over the years, we've seen the volumes grow. We've seen the hallways fill. We've longed for a space like this. And for this to happen over the last three years so quickly and now be a reality, makes us very proud for the work that our teams have done, but really proud of the work that the community has done to bring this to reality. This has been a long time coming and the community really deserves what we're going to do for them. It is just such a moment of pride and also though just a moment of gratitude to the community who have allowed us to build this hospital. This new space, this expansion is going to mean that we're able to treat more patients and the patients are going to be treated in state-of-the-art, bright, beautiful space that has been designed, you know, really with patients and families in mind. 
I don't think we could be more excited than we are for this.